for me as an artist that I'm really not believing style. I think style is when artists compromising themselves for the market because they realize they can use the signatures to sell as much as work that they can. So they're starting to repeat themselves to meeting the requirement of the market. But obviously there's no market around me because no one really want to buy my art uh, unless they want to really cross the Chinese government losing their share in the China's cake. So I do not really have this concern to keep my art in one style, in one purpose. For me, every work is unique and different, and it requires a different language to approach to it. I think, well, artist is this creature. It could really squeeze our lives in facing all the difficulties, whether it's financially or personal struggle. But the bottom line for artists is that you have to have complete freedom to deliver the message whatever the way you like. So with that understanding, I think there's no artist in China because there's no freedom of speech in China. The ones who are still active in China uh, are mainly just decoration for the propaganda or actually the tool of propaganda. A lot of Chinese artists deceiving themselves think if they can sell their work with millions of dollars, they are real artists. But no, for me, they're not artists at all. The ones I know, of course, they are real people trying to struggle inside of China. But they, they never really given a fair chance to express themselves. Or they've already ended up in the jails and disappeared. So in China, it's really, really difficult to be artist unless you've made a decision to sacrifice yourself totally. As many people might already know that I'm very recognized as a political cartoonist online, but opportunity like this to having an exhibition in a gallery space in Blisha is totally new to me. And I do think, you know, on different venues that serves a different purpose, and in different venues you're talking to different kind of audiences. And I particularly really want to do more exhibitions like this in the future. But of course this will not happen if I am not supported and appreciated and understand by the general public. So in the future, I do hope this exhibition could open the doors uh, for me to doing more you know, art uh, shows in a proper gallery and so that I can talk to different group of audience which are different from the ones that, that I used to talk to online. Uh, but also I want to extend my um, practice to more different revenues including publishing books, graphic novels, game design, and also online digital art like NFT art. I think I love all my works. It's, it will be a very silly question to ask any artist what is their favorite art. Every art is like my finger. Do I love my middle finger the most or the thumb the most? I can't really tell. But I guess what I can say is I love the next of my work.